Hi guys, um, I hope this video helps you. We have a VW Jetta here which we're in, as you can see on the uh, the instrument cluster there, we have the engine warning light showing. Um, bit of background information, we've already uh, diagnosed the faults and we've, uh, we've narrowed it down to a faulty uh, mass airflow meter and a faulty map sensor. Uh, so we've gone ahead and changed those out. Um, what I'm going to do though is I'm just going to go in and diagnose the faults as if they were still there. Uh, well they are still there until, they, until we clear them actually but uh, I'm going to read codes. I'm going to show you what codes I was getting when I uh, diagnosed this. So it's uh, a 275 air intake sem sensor, uh, a 568 manifold pressure boost sensor and 258 mass airflow sensor. So uh, those faults uh, generally sort of led me to believe that it was a fault with the uh, the MAP sensor which is the uh, the manifold pressure the 568 and the uh, the MAF sensor which is the 275 and the 258 uh, so we've we've put the new parts in there and we're just now to the stage where we can erase the codes and hopefully get this engine warning light off so engines on and engines so ignition on engine stop but well, we don't need to worry about that that's not going to affect anything we'll click yes to that uh, as you saw there, the engine warning light has disappeared. And this has been a success. We can go in and read the codes again. Now oh, we need to just reset the engine there. Uh, but the codes have gone. And the engine light has gone for good there. So uh, it's just really a case um, of sort of um, picking this tool up and then diagnosing the engine. It will, it will cover lots of other situations such as uh, airbags, ABS, engine and transmission, things like that. Uh, but it's an excellent tool. But if you are interested in it, just click the link directly below this video um, and it will take you to the page on our website. Thanks for watching.